Here we go! Pikachu versus Snake! I didn't... I, I, I think we got the tags mixed up. I'm pretty sure Shy Guy's... Shy Guy's the one playing. Yeah, Pikachu, Shy Guy right? should be the Pikachu. Yeah. Jaleel, who formerly went by the tag Rain in Smash 4. Oh, Bayonetta. that's Rain! Yeah, he played Bayonetta in that game. He switched to Snake very quickly, so I remember fighting him pretty soon after the game started. And, yeah, the guy is absolutely pretty good. good. Yeah, he's pretty, pretty good. dang good. Actually, when I... <laughs> when, uh, when Shy Guy heard he was playing against, he's like, Who's that guy? Did he beat Raid? But, you know, Shy but uh, Guy... In a way, he did beat Raid. He beat him and replaced him. Shy Guy, fun fact, he's got some pretty good notoriety against me. He actually beat Salem uh, at a major. So... Yeah, but that was when Salem wasn't playing a hero. <laughs> that was before that Hero's time. time. That was that was before he had something to prove to laugh at. Right. I think that was at Pound, right? When Shy Guy did No, that? I believe that was, was Glitch. Glitch? Okay. It's pretty cool though. Shy Guy's showing he's uh, definitely got the EXP versus the grown bearded man. Actually he played now that I remember I think he played Link. Really? Wow. Uh, yeah, I think he beat his link if I remember, but I might be wrong because I am often wrong. Well, what, what I'm trying to say is watching <laughs> these two guys <laughs> against each other is quite the treat. <laughs> Shot guy, though, I mean, Pikachu does well in this matchup for the most part. He is very small. He is old, old. wily, yeah. you know? And his combo game and his offstage play are pretty much unparalleled. I feel like Pikachu, in general, must be really hard to, like, nab with the Kita. Just the amount of options yeah. he has in terms of stalling, in terms of angles, in terms definitely. of everything. The character has one of, if not the best, recovery in the game. Yeah, so. definitely an all-around uh, pick. Has an answer to pretty much any situation to throw at him. Damn. Pikachu is super high, too. Yeah, Pikachu's a character in this game kind of feels like he has few, if any, weaknesses. Oh! What the hell? Oh, in the tech, though! <laughs> that is okay. so funny. Back to Small Blast Zone's not doing him any favors. Oh, it's great amazing. read on the spot, Dodge. And that Shy Guy, it feels like he's very much in control. When you have a big combo like that and you finish it with a spot dodge read, you really kind of have a handle on how scared your opponent is of you. I'm actually surprised at how common uh, get up spot dodge is. It's, it's something more players should look to punish in those high tenacity situations. What I'm liking about this matchup is I feel like I've watched way more neutral than ledge play. Yeah, well, you I mean, know? I think that it's... For the most part, well, for the most part, Jaleel has been recovering high, so Shy Guy hasn't had the chance to, you know, ledge trap him, and Pikachu just gets off ledge for free, basically, because he's Pikachu. So, yeah, this is something that a lot of the times you actually don't see in Ultimate, where there, a lot of the, it's not damage being dealt and stocks being taken at the ledge. Instead, it's a lot of the center stage pull that we're seeing. For the most part, Pikachu actually seems pretty comfortable. Oh, <laughs> I was gonna say uh, hanging out towards the corner, and I guess that's true because he just died in the middle. So, <laughs> oh, 22% off of that forward air. I was recently talking with somebody about what the most triggering game in Ultimate is. You know, some people are like, "Oh, Palunair," you know, all this thing. You mean the triggering move? Triggering move. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> like the move that you get hit with, and it just turns your brain into a pile of raging hormones. Uh, point is, for me, that snake down there and forward air. Yeah, he the does The moves do so much damage. He does a chunky amount of damage. <laughs> An Augustus group amount. Oh. Thank you for the chunk. <laughs> I appreciate it, Barry. Oh I assume goodness. you did chuckle at me, not some... Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness, just missing the mark with the forward smash. We've got ourselves an even game, folks. This could be anybody's <gasps> right here. Oh, this is huge. 
doesn't go for a ledge trap. Oh my god! I mean, a tech chase. Did you know you could headbutt the Nikita and not <gasps> die for it? <laughs> and you could SDI up smash and just... Uh, <laughs> wow, shy guy. Should be okay here. Jeez. Who he knew? He in his hand. It blows up on him. He's now at 120. This is... Oh, this is so scary for both players. But for the Pikachu, it looks like it's gonna be... <laughs> <laughs> Rip and yeah, you can see the shy guy like looking up at the to the heavens, just give us some roll of his eyes. Yeah. He knows he had that. He's like, I was. He was in pretty control. far ahead, but you know, Snake is a heavy boy, and Jaleel's a patient boy. You put those two together, and uh, you get you get a man who joy. doesn't move. Much. <laughs> oh, there, that oh. that too. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. I was looking for a rhyme, and he's like, I'm just going to finish your sentence. <laughs> <laughs> I just like the idea. The, the, what happens when you combine a big boy with a patient boy? Also, yes. Use a guy who doesn't move. User name, username, that's you? Yeah. Um, yes, this is Kev. Hello. Three, Joined by Salty Is that salty different fun. than username? User name. <laughs> is that not username? It's, I, I'm pretty sure it is. I don't know. It might be different than username. Anyway, so even though he won the last game, we see the character counterpick to Joker. Uh, some interesting things about that. One, I know that Jokers, they are like, this character doesn't lose any matchups. It's never beat the Joker. Uh, you know, I'm actually thinking if, if it is true, as somebody that means Joker, you know. I, I feel like if it is true that Pika wins, that it's like 55-45. And yeah, it's not. It's not. Usually, it's not like Joker can't play within that window. But it's like know? counter picking to. I mean, I guess it's. It, it just feels like maybe the character would be better equipped to deal with Shy Guy's style of Pikachu than his uh than his Snake was. You know what I actually think it might be. Hear me out. Pika on Kalos is like a nightmare for every character. But think about a character. Oh well. Think about a character that has an answer to the Thunder Jolts. He could just R send them in. You know, Rebel's Guard. You know, he's got a lot of space, and Joker thrives by having a lot of space. Um, I, I, I think that thought. Snake as well on the stage, too. But anyway, eh. regardless, he <laughs> has switched to Joker, and he does have another game to work with. It's one of those weird things where because he counterpicked after getting a win, if he loses, he can just go back to the Snake. Right. He has a game three that he can fall back on here. So, yeah. By the way, can you answer this for me because I am an unenlightened swine? Uh, Joker's, the way his meter adds up, is it based on how much damage he takes or the amount of hits? So, like, do multi hits charge it faster? Okay, so any amount of percent that's tacked onto him is going to increase the gauge. If he's holding down B, it's going to increase faster, and then over time, it also steadily just goes up or down depending on if he has it or not. Okay, so but right now, like it's going down by time, but now he's. It's gonna go up very, very steadily. But by is that the same well. for Arsene? So does Arsene, if he gets hit by a bunch of multi hits, it only goes down a little yep. bit because it okay. goes down more. However, when he rebels guards, he often will hit, he'll get each of the multi hits mm -hmm. with it, and so he'll yeah. charge it up like all the way. Yep. Okay. Yeah, you see it there on each on each piece of the back here, you could see it going up. Of course, right. Joker wasn't recently nerfed. Very slight, but appropriate. You know, that's the way I think everyone has sort of agreed with it. Where the yeah. character is still probably the best in the game. If you be if you believed he was the best in the game before, you probably still believe that. Maybe I don't know. I I look to Pika, and I think this character has so many things going for him. But um, you know, as you're saying, with the nerfs, they definitely don't hurt Joker too bad. But I do think the guns being changed will. Definitely make Joker have to work a little bit harder on the uh, offensive front. Oh, look at oh, this God. combo going on right now, though. Oh, never mind, Joker. There's never sense here to combo break him out of it. I, Jaleel trying to guess where Shy Guy is going to be, shaking his head in frustration. This feels like there was that one point in game one where it felt like Shy Guy had a really good read on where Jaleel was going, you know? And at the end of his combo, he punished it with the, you know, trying to spot dodge and Shy Guy punished it. I feel like that confidence is the same we're seeing right now from Shy Guy, where he gets in his face and he will do all this crazy stuff, and then he reads that pivotal defensive option. He needs to take a stock, which he does. Nice. What a all way right. to punish the Rebels guard. He's like, what are you doing? Get off the stage. <laughs> 
And of course, with that Rebel's Guard, in case you don't know, which I used to not, um, it he lasts for as long before he takes the mask down. The Q, it's not like other counters where, you know, you just have the timing and then you, you know, unleash your move. Mm. You have to look at him and as soon as he puts the mask down, that's when he is no longer countered. Okay. That's... Because you can hold him. <laughs> yeah, and his reason for holding the mask, here's some Persona lore for you, is that... Oh boy. Is that if he does... <laughs> not get Persona the, 4. If he does... Persona lore. Yeah, yeah if, if he does get the fully charged... While he's getting hit, he rips the mask off his face at the end, and then Arsene unleashes, because Arsene is in the mask. Uh, That's why the song Beneath the Mask is there. That's his persona. But anyway. Uh, <laughs> okay. We're back to Snake, I watched like the you Persona said. 5 anime. I know what this is about. <laughs> I did. I watched the Persona 5 anime because I was like, eh. I'm not going to be able to play the Persona 5 game, so I'll just get the general gist before Joker mm -hmm. comes out. It was not good. It's bad. Don't yeah, watch it's it. It's really only good if you played the game and you understand Even then, I happened. heard everyone who played the game said it was worse because they're like, it's just not the game. Yeah, it's, like, it's basically what's in the game, but all briefly summarized. I will say they had their bits and pieces of good things, but we should probably get to commentating this. Never. <laughs> Let's talk, Never. Let's Let's talk, talk about, about the important things. <laughs> like the Persona 5 anime. Oh my goodness. Or the fact that Shy Guy just got up tilted at 150. He had a pretty sizable lead. He there, had a very sizable struggle lead. Struggling to about land. About 80 to 90%. Struggling to land and struggling to kill. Finally taking the stock right there. I agree with that. That taunt absolutely hurt. He was earned. waving to the crowd. He said, nah, no he was waving me. to his opponent. <laughs> he's just like, you You haven't demoralized me yet. <laughs> and maybe he's trying to frustrate him. And he's like, oh, I bet you thought you were going to have a big lead now. Oh. You know, Mr. Snake with the stock lead, but you thought it was going to be really, really, really good for you. But nah, peek a peek -a. Ooh, I like the up air into back air. Bear into up air into back air. That's cute. I didn't know Pika could do that. Does they Pika usually just go straight up for more back airs. Does Pika not get hit by C4 if it's on the platform above him and it gets detonated? Uh... It probably depends if he's standing or not. I mean, just straight standing. Um, I don't know. I know it, it'll like hit a lot of really short characters, but I thought I just now I saw it happen. Maybe he was in the middle of running, which made him low profile. I don't know. Oh, good catch! Getting wow. him at the top. What a another situation where Shy Guy has a really sizable lead against Snake, and it's on an Animal Crossing stage, but a much smaller one. And he lost that last time. Mm -hmm. Don't forget he has yet to actually take a game from this snake. Well, and even though he has yeah. a big lead, that's this it could very well shape out like it did before. He had a huge lead and he wasn't able to close out the stock. It doesn't matter how much damage he does oh if he's never God. able to finish the job. Yo, he's in there like swimwear. He is catching all of Jaleel's recoveries and options. Ooh. But once again, I, my mind is just like thinking about to a minute from now when how is Shy Guy gonna actually take the stock? In a minute from now, you don't you think that's how hard it is to kill Snake? I yes, I would be shocked if this match oh. does not last at least another minute. Oh, the I would curse be shocked. Commentator, commentating. That's not the curse <laughs> of commentary. That, that's exactly what I'm saying is happening. We have at least another thirty seconds, and I think that great. I'm oh, sorry. Jaleel here can absolutely survive. In fact, the fact that Shy Guy was so upset over that kill means that he understands mm. the risk involved here. Right. He could still lose this game. Right. Absolutely. <gasps> and right as I say that, he gets the forward smash. It lasts so long, and he takes him down. That was something we hadn't really seen. A